All right, welcome. Uh, this is a video tutorial about working with Excel. Uh, in this video tutorial, I'm going to teach you about working with text to columns. And I'll give you some examples about how that works here in just a second. Um, this video is brought to you by MotherlessGoat.com. Uh, we have a lot of video tutorials on our homepage for you to watch and teach yourself things. Um, we also offer any product that you need to get your business online and on the web. So whether you need a website built, or you need domain names registered for your new business, email plans, hosting plans, e-commerce, uh, storefronts, SSL certificates, fax through email, anything you need, we've got it. And we're open 24 hours a day to help you. We never close. So please keep that in mind if you have any friends or family members that might be needing products. And also if you want to go and watch the free tutorials. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to head over to an Excel spreadsheet. Let's see here. There we are. So let's say, for example, you've got a bunch of contents. And some of that contents you want to kind of split in half. Maybe there's a, a comma or a period or something in there that you want to split that component over to column B. So let's say, for example, I just want the names of these domains in column A, but I want .com in column B. Well, rather than going in here and wiping out .com and then putting .com in here and moving it around, well, what you can do is you can highlight the cells. Well, I'm just going to click on A here to highlight the entire row. Let's say I had thousands and thousands of names here. I'm going to go up here to the data uh, tab up here at the top. Keep in mind your Excel spreadsheet might look a little bit different, so you'll want to find the data one. And then I'm going to go to text to columns. So now when I'm here, I'm going to click the Next button. And now I need to tell it what feature I want to use as the parameter to separate these. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to choose a period. So I'm going to undo the tab. I'm going to click in there, get rid of the check mark box. And I'm going to come over here to Other. And I'm going to put in a period there. Now it depends upon what your spreadsheet has in it. It might have spaces. It might have semicolons or commas, so you need to choose what you're going to use as the component that tells it, you know, what to separate. But in mine, I've got periods, so I'm going to choose periods. I'm going to click finish, and watch what happens right over here. See, it just separated them. It got rid of the periods. It moved the dot coms over here, and that's how you work with text to columns using Excel. Thank you for watching, and if you want to watch other video tutorials, please visit us over at Motherless Goat. And also, if you need any products, please keep us in mind. You can create an account and register with any products or give us a call. We're more than willing to help you, and we look forward to having you as a customer. Thank you. Bye.